you've been driving up I-75 recently, you might have noticed a few bumps in the road. The Tennessee Department of Transportation is currently working to change that. But as TDOT repairs the damaged concrete, bottleneck traffic might slow you down over the weekend. News 12's Chris Ewan joins us now live in the studio with what you can expect if you're planning on driving down 75. Chris. It's no secret that you're likely to hit a pothole or two if you're driving on I-75 near Volkswagen Drive. And TDOT is working to fix that. But road repairs bring traffic slowdowns. And this weekend, those repairs are closing three lanes of traffic near Old Lee Highway. The portion of I-75 that runs through Hamilton County currently features several potholes and cracks in the concrete. Starting tonight at 9 p.m., the Tennessee Department of Transportation will begin laying down new concrete to rehabilitate the road. As a result, there will be lane closures until 6 a.m. on Monday. The contractor plans to close the three outside lanes and outside shoulder of I-75 North from mile marker 6.6 .6 to mile marker 9.0 meaning that I-75 north through this area will be reduced to two lanes, which will be the inside lane and the inside shoulder through these limits. In addition to restoring damaged concrete slabs, the project will repair bridges in the area. And while this set of lane closures only lasts until Monday, the project will continue in the coming months. There will be an upcoming long-term closure as part of this project. So the contractor plans to close two lanes on I-75 in both directions at mile marker 8.4, which is near exit 9 or the Volkswagen Drive exit, beginning in August for 30 days. According to TDOT, it's scheduled to conclude on November 15th. According to TDOT, work on the section of I-75 near Volkswagen Drive may actually continue over the course of the next several weeks. Traffic delays should be expected. Live in the studio, Chris Skewen, News 12 Now.